Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have such an exciting video. I'm going to be doing the luxury items I can't live without tag video. And I was tagged by the one and only beautiful Jerusha Couture. I mean, I was so honored to even be mentioned by her and I love her so much. She, I've been watching her forever and she is one of the huge YouTube influencers on me to even start my own channel so thank you so much babe for tagging me and I was so excited to film this and this tag was created by Ava from Ava in the city and she's awesome too I love her channel as well and so I will definitely be linking both of their videos or versions of this tag video below so anyways without further ado let's get started okay you guys so for the first thing on this tag it is a handbag obviously this is an extremely difficult you know tag to do because I love all my handbags obviously but really it came down to sentimental reasons and um, I will also show you the bag that it was kind of like that was like right behind it as well and the bag that I chose I mean it's really no surprise um, is my Chanel jumbo single flap I absolutely adore this bag I mean you guys know that this is my holy grail handbag so that kind of was just the main tiebreaker and um, I love it. I mean, the function of it is amazing as well. I mean, it's a fantastic everyday black handbag. You could take it from daytime to evening. You can carry as little or as much as you really want in here. And it's just such an amazing bag. I, I do feel like, you know, especially because this is something that isn't made anymore, it is harder to find. And the other bag that was sort of right behind it was my Neverfull. And with the Neverfull, I'll show you guys a little bit of eye candy with the Neverfull. I absolutely adore this bag, but at the end of the day, it is replaceable, and my Chanel Jumbo just isn't. Um, and yeah, so this baby definitely took the spot for this. Love it. Next on the list was an SLG. Um, this, again, was hard for me to choose, and I do feel like the mini pochette and the key clay were like oh right there next to each other but if i'm gonna grab only one slg out of my handbag to go run an errand go grab coffee go to the gym go to the grocery store just do anything really pretty much is my key clay and obvious for obvious reasons obviously it holds my keys but then it also could hold my card and my id and cash and coins and things like that so it really is the handiest you know, SLG. It's not my favorite SLG. Legit, Jerusha spoke upon this too. It's it's not about favorites. You know, it's really, you really have to really think about it. But, you know, for the handbag it was different because that is my favorite handbag. But this is something that I truly, truly can't live without. I absolutely love this and it'll last me forever. So I do, um, I do take that into consideration as far as any of my luxury items. I mean, these pieces really you don't really have to rebuy. I mean, unless you're just like obsessed and you just have to, we all are. So I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. But um, I do love the Damier Azur print. Excuse my nails, ew. Um, I do love the Damier Azur print, but I kind of regret not getting in the monogram print just because this will get dirty. Um, and it's gotten dirty a little bit, but I still love it. And it's just so pretty and cute. And it is like a little bright pop of color in all of my handbags. So I do love this piece. Okay, next was a shoe. And if you've been following me for a while, you know that the one type of shoe that I like to even invest any sort of money in are boots. It's my style aesthetic. I wear them all year round. I even wear them in the summer. I think they look really cute with summer dresses. It sort of gives like a 90s grunge vibe. But I had to choose my Fiorentini and Baker Eli boots just because these for some reason I feel are just so timeless I always I mean for me it's always going to be my personal style to have a pair of like biker or like industrial looking boots and they're just so easy to throw on with leggings jeans dresses whatever you want even sweatpants it gives it sort of like this cool edge without trying and I just absolutely adore these Fiorentini and Baker in general is so robust and it lasts forever I mean I feel like these could be run over by a truck and they will still look like this I mean they get better with age and they're just amazing I mean I recommend this brand in general so they do carry all sorts of styles but you know they're all kind of in the category of like more industrial looking like a little bit chunkier but I just I don't know I just love these boots love them so next is jewelry I don't own any luxury or designer jewelry so I just chose my 
one piece of fine jewelry that I will never get rid of, I will never live without. I never take it off, like, I've never taken it off since I've gotten it. And it is my ring from my mom when I graduated high school. It's a Mystic Fire Topaz um, in, in gold with diamonds on the side of it. I don't want to get too close, it's so dirty. That's not okay to show but I'm absolutely in love with this ring it's so sentimental to me so um it means a lot so I would never ever live without this ring next was makeup or perfume I chose a makeup item and it is my Chanel Rouge Coco lip balm I mean you guys I can never use another lip balm again in my life or like a clear lip balm I mean I'm lying I do just so that I don't waste this and this is already my second one and I absolutely love it I'm wearing it today it leaves just a beautiful sheen and it's so pretty a lot of the times people ask me what color lipstick or lip gloss i'm wearing my lips are already like naturally like this like tinted dark pink color but this enhances it and it makes it look so pretty and i absolutely love it so i highly highly recommend this lip balm to anyone and i'm pretty sure everyone has it already and i'm very late to the game but if you don't pick it up try it you'll never go back ever again all right, last on the list was a miscellaneous item, and this is considered an SLG, but I don't care. <laughs> and it is my agenda from Louis Vuitton. It's the MM size and monogram print. And this is my life book, you guys. I mean, it has everything in it, obviously. My work schedule, my regular schedule, anything, appointments. Um, I do my YouTube, you know, ideas in here, my fashion blog ideas in here, my finances, my to-do lists, everything is in here. I really truly cannot live without this. I look at it every single day and um, I don't take it with me everywhere every day but maybe four days out of the week it's with me and I absolutely love it so definitely definitely cannot live without this. This had to make this tag video. All right, you guys, that is it. Thank you so much for watching. This was so fun to do, and I love watching these videos. So thank you so much again to Jerusha for tagging me, babe. This was so fun. And um, thank you so much to Eva for even creating this tag video. And I would like to tag everyone. I would love everyone to do this, but there are a few specific people that I want to give a shout out to to do this. And the first person is Amy Jo. I love her videos and she's super sweet, so I'd love to see her version of this. I would love to see Shay Whitney do it. I love her. I did a collaboration with her not too long ago and she's fantastic. She's so sweet. And I would love to see Jen G do this. I don't know if she's gonna see this, but I would love for Jen G to do this. And then I would also love KW Shops and Miss Geekly Chic to do this as well. So I'll leave everyone I tag below and obviously I'm tagging everyone as well. Thank you so much to everyone for watching and I will see you guys next time. Bye! Mwah.